a very unusual public feud between the president of the United States and the Republican majority leader of the United States Senate. And this is all about the so far unsuccessful attempts to repeal and replace Obamacare. Let's just look at the president's tweet this morning. Can you believe that Mitch McConnell, who has screamed repeal and replace for seven years, couldn't get it done, must repeal and replace Obamacare with an exclamation mark there? First, it is no secret that the president has had zero ability to persuade the Republican senators to vote for the bill the last time it came before the Senate. That said, it's also true that over the last 24 hours, the president has tweeted twice now about Mitch McConnell, though you can say in some ways Mitch McConnell started all of this with some remarks he made in his home state of Kentucky before the Rotary Club. Listen. Now, our new president has, of course, not been in this line of work before. And I think had excessive expectations about how quickly things happen in the democratic process. What's striking about this is that our Sarah Murray reports the president and Mitch McConnell had a telephone call just yesterday. That conversation was described as animated over some of these very same issues. But what seems clear right now, at least, is that the president and the man the president needs to push his agenda through the Senate haven't buried the hatchet yet.